Hi, I'm Aaron from Everybody Active, part of Armagh City, Banbridge and Craig Avonborough Council. Today we're going to do some ball manipulation exercises, so ranging from ball juggling, single ball juggling, pull and pushes, so rolls and a few little others. This time we're just going to do a little bit of ball juggling. So you're going to use left foot and right foot, you can use thigh, um, chest, head, any combination you want. Make it nice and simple. Start off with try to put your foot on the ball and get the ball up. So rather than dropping the ball like that, do keep it up if you can. Start with the ball on the ground. So use your sole to roll it back and get it up. And you kind of do both feet. Keep your eye on the ball. the ball lower, keep going higher, it's hard to control it, keep it lower, light on your feet, once you've got comfortable using both feet for the juggles, so a little bit like that, once you're comfortable doing that, you can then try and do single leg juggles, so you're going to require a little bit more balance. So effectively, you're using one foot to do the keep, keep ups, the other foot you're trying to stabilise yourself. So you're keeping the ball low, and then you're trying to challenge yourself. It's really, really soft touches. Focusing on the ball, focusing on making sure your opposite foot stays flat, stationary on the ball. Just challenge yourself, see how long you can go for, and then maybe try and throw in a little inside. Let's see. This time, just a little bit of ball familiarity exercises. So, little toe taps. So, I'm just going to go for 10 seconds, but your job would be to go fast. So, when you're doing it, if you go too quick or you stamp on the ball, the ball is going to roll away from you, so you're just going to get contact with the ball. So it's sole of foot to touch the top of the ball. So it's like that. If you go like that, that's nice and easy. Then you're trying to get on the move, so you're on the bounce. You're literally little jumps. You do that as quick as you can. Once that's easy, then you try to do it on the move, so think of a compass going forwards, north, south, east and west. So take the ball forwards, take the ball backwards, look over your shoulder, take the ball to the side, and back to the other side. And you can test yourself on that by pulling for as long as you can, for 30 seconds or 60 seconds, or as many touches. Okay, so you can do some side to side. So try not to have your legs straight. Just make them a little bit looser, soften your knees. And you're just trying to get contact between the two insides of your foot. So it's little touches between both feet. Again, it's not hard. It's soft contact. And try to keep the ball between both feet to make it more challenging. Can you move forwards? the ball, can you move backwards, just have a look over your shoulder, can you move to the side, can you move to the other side, and again you can challenge yourself. This time it's sole rolls, so roll the ball across your body, so if you're left footed, you can move the ball towards the right, so it would be roll the ball with your left foot across your body to the right and step right to the left, stepping with your left leg, rolling the ball with your right foot across your body to the left. Just roll it and move. Roll it and move. Then you can roll it backwards. Then you can roll it forwards. And then try on the hop and go forwards. Try and roll it backwards. Roll it to the side. Roll it across your body. Roll it forwards. Can 
experiment on that on left foot and right foot and you can also do outside roll so roll the ball with the outside of your left foot roll it with the outside of the right foot roll it with the inside outside inside outside outside inside and so on this time i'm going to do a big toe little toe or inside outside so if i'm using my left foot here the big toe would be the inside little toe would be the outside so you're trying to create as if you're going on a zigzag to walk through it would be just be nice and light your feet so be inside outside inside outside inside outside inside outside or I've got a big toe, little toe, 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 big toe, little toe. turn. If you want to then try to do it and challenge yourself, try and then use your other foot. So in this sense, it's right foot. So the big toe takes it inside, little toe outside, inside, outside, inside, outside, inside, outside, 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 outside. stop. At this time, you're going to pull and push. So. Just pull and push the ball in front of you. So we'll start off with, if I use my left foot, it's the sole of the foot that's going to do the pull. And then you're going to plant your foot like that. And you're going to push the ball with the laces. So it's pull, push, pull, push, pull, push. Then you tread on your right foot, pull it, push it, pull it, push it. So you're trying to get that movement. Again, you need to have good balance on your other foot. Arms just to give you balance. Okay, once you've got comfortable doing that, Try to go left foot, right foot, left foot, right foot. So it's pull, push, pull, push, pull, push, pull, push, pull, push, pull, push. That's easy. Then add a little on the hop, feel like on the bounce. So it's pull and push, 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 pull and push. Then you try and go quicker. But obviously be aware when the quicker you go, if your touch is too hard, the ball run away from you. So you got to concentrate. You touch again go for 30 seconds, go for 40 seconds, go for 60 seconds, or just go for our own toggle. Okay, so you can do some little simple traps. Tread on your stronger leg first and then tread on your other leg. So throw the ball up, keep your eye on the ball, and try and use the laces to trap it. It's not easy, it will take practice. Just throw it up, try and bring the ball down. What you keep your eye on the ball. You try to cushion the ball. Then throw it up, trap it, go for a little dribble. Then you might want to try and trap it on the inside of the foot, which is very hard. Try and get your foot up. That's so easy. You trap it on the outside. So you're just dropping your foot in a little bit. Better. Right. 